Hey guys, Jag Reviews here, and today we are going to be looking at Strike Cobra. He has two cool features, and he also comes with this barrel, which you probably, if you saw my review, saw on Twin Drosros. Um, first off, he has, well obviously the barrel that comes with him, and then the other cool part is he has this piece that holds this special trigger you can see that there's this groove almost and like that's normal trigger it doesn't have this top piece on it so you can't use this part unless if you switch the trigger so he is a precision type and I'm going to do a couple tests with that later but first let's do a power test Turn that up diamonds Sign that up. Use the glass marbles. I hit the side of it. Hold on. Okay. So it's it's not very powerful. It's sort of what's to be expected from this style. I mean, it's not a power type. Um Let's take some shots down at those targets, see if we can hit them, and I guess we will use the barrel. Um, one thing I do have to say, the barrel itself is pretty good, but if you're using this grip and you're pulling, you can unalign the barrel and then your shots will curve and go everywhere you don't want them to. Another thing is, you can use the little peg on his head and the sight piece to line up with your target. As you can see, you can line, okay, there we go. This little nub up with the line here, and then you aim with that. So let's see if I can actually do it. Got that one. Let's go for. That was my fault. There we go. Oh, the other one came back up. There we go. So, as you can see, he is pretty accurate. He's pretty accurate without the barrel, but the barrel helps definitely. Um, if you do use it, like I said, I wouldn't really recommend this because you can misalign it. Now, I'm going to try and show you the extra part he does, but I have to use a screwdriver because it's pretty hard to get these pieces to come out. So let's see. Now it's stiff, holy. Okay. So in his feet, these come out, they slide out and it's for extra stability. I honestly think it works quite nice. Like this guy, if I'm I'm pushing down, but I'm pushing that way and it's not really falling. Now let's see if we put something like this on. If it would, I think it's gonna fall just because they're more on the sides. I mean, he's standing. I mean, he's standing up. The back little nubs right there are definitely helping. Otherwise, he would have fallen right over. Uh, he is very comfortable. These shoulder pads are nice and smooth. And they feel really nice on your fingers. And even a little bit on these Cobra bits, the smooth parts here, they're comfortable to hold too. So he's definitely very solid. This trigger part definitely helps because if you have ever played with these before, you'll know if you do try and push the trigger over and shoot that you will, not always, but sometimes get a weird angle. Um, I'm gonna set up the precision test, which is new. You guys haven't seen it before. And then we're gonna do some break bomb. So we're gonna cut to that. Here's the precision test. If you can't tell, it is that bridge that they had from the one episode now. They might fall into these gaps, but if it makes it all the way to the end, it means the marble was on the line. We're going to try and hit the target. No guarantees, and I am going to be using this barrel. And I'm going to use the glass marbles. I'm going to use the side holes.
We will jump off the sides if you don't hit it perfectly. Well, there we go. It almost has to bounce a little just because of the fact that there's all those gaps. But this guy is definitely better precision wise than say someone like Spike Phoenix. Like if I were to load this guy up, I don't even think he'll, oh wait, hold on, his safety's not on. Yeah, it, it jumped over the brake bar, so it's too powerful. Um, in a second, we are going to cut to some brake bomb. Now, before I start the brake bomb, one thing is I have only reviewed one precision type before this guy, and that is Christ Radra. I did not do the bridge test with him, so if you guys would like me to, just let me know in the comments below. Um, I'm going to start the brake bomb field and take some shots. Hopefully this magazine does not jam like the last time I used it. Definitely shoots very straight. Like I said, I am using the barrel, but even without, he does pretty well. ever have any ideas for a test or like a 1v1 matchup that you guys would like me to do with these guys let me know because I would probably do it if I have what you need to do it. turn the uh, field off so as you can see very accurate definitely would recommend buying him his rapid fire is semi decent his power is okay i don't know if this really does it justice because he is able to knock the blocks out with a decent amount of ease i definitely like how these foot parts come out but they are hard to get in and out I had to use a screwdriver, a flathead screwdriver to pop them out. And I'm not fully sure how I'm gonna get them back in. As you can see, they don't want to go in. But that is really all I had for today. So I guess this is Jag Reviews signing off.